home. That's the that's kind of our one of our main goals here coming into icons is having characters that you feel Three, familiar with two, right off the bat, one, so you can pick it up go. no matter you know what other characters are. You can come in here and have a comfortable have, have a character you're comfortable with. Mm -hmm. And Zana is our uh, more of like a fighting game, traditional fighting game character that we model after. I don't know if you can tell. He has some moves from famous wrestlers from maybe Street Fighter. Mm. Uh, my favorite move of hers is the Lariat. It uh, can make for some pretty funny moments, but she, she gets a lot of combos and a lot of, uh, ooh, right there is a counter. But does she go past projectiles when she does it? So initially she did, Okay. but she was uh, getting a lot of mileage off that. Really so no. Well, actually that doesn't surprise me at all. So <laughs> we decided to actually take it off of her so she can still Reflect projectiles. Obviously, everyone has a projectile reflect yeah. with shield gusting, which is shield plus the special button. And uh, but instead of reflecting with her with her counter, she now just kind of like parries it. Come, uh, and that's kind of what we gave her to deal with uh, the projectile game. Got it. So with her side special, she doesn't go through projectiles just yet. But if you kind of like reach the end of her side special, she kind of has like a pseudo like almost like pseudo range on it like it'll cancel out moves that are just starting if she grabs you and most of her combos start off of her grabs okay so she can get some really good stuff no no i mean she, she definitely just looks like a grappler that would you know a couple good normals there in the air to go ahead Ooh. and try to space out again the lariat already so with the lariat you can, you can definitely just so lariat is their neutral is the neutral special or the neutral b you can just tap that forever and skip forever oh if you want and you yes <laughs> and you can move uh, you can move si uh, slightly with it across the stage if you wanted to. That's a better taunt than anything. <laughs> <laughs> oh my Ooh. goodness. Okay. York, are you sure you haven't played this game? York has <laughs> definitely played before. Oh, Why are you lying to the people? York the has the play team. showing out. Definitely Smirking and everything before. too? Okay. Yeah, now he knows what he's doing. Uh, good game one right there coming out from York. You see so, any character switches? No, it's going to the stages. As soon as Zana gets in on anybody, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a sad time because of the way that she can kind of like implement either hitting you far away with her strong hits or grappling you. you it really chooses you into that kind of traditional fighter like 50-50 with like any grappler. You have to make some either shield or attack, right? These are your two decisions to make against her. So when she gets comboed, it hurts a lot, but if you get hit by her, you can expect to lose a stock. <laughs> uh, basically just like that. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> be the ledge guard. Oh, just rolling back up. Don't think he was expecting to grab the ledge there. <laughs> so if you get grabbed by Zana side B here, even in a you know if you take her online and you run into a Zana, if she's side Bing you, you want to di away. You want to hold the control stick away. At the end of that grab, it'll be much harder for her to follow up. Um, at lower percents, it's a bit difficult to do because you will go less far away from every time she grabs you. But at, at medium, like 50% and above, you should definitely hold the control stick away as far as possible when she, uh, by the time she releases you. All right, so obviously Ratshark just did not listen to you on that last talk. Nope. Still, still going to get whacked by, by, <laughs> by that forwarder. So, so if, you're, if you're no DI-ing, uh, DI, which is directional influence, uh, you will just kind of fall into Zana's uh, aerial every time. It's a free combo for her. I mean, if you're trying to get acquainted with Zana, yo, go ahead and don't DI. Oh, here we go. No, Ratshark actually not doing too bad. Has York on the list, but immediately Ooh. just changing the tables. That's uh, the right there. You, the dash through is something new okay. we've added to a sword, our swordsman. Is uh, you'd be able to dash through, and it's a strong hitbox at the very end of that dash. Ooh, the back throw. Oh my gosh. Zana over here trying to charge the side strike there. Got a lot of these side specials coming off from Rat Shark. Actually getting a lot of mileage out of it too. Good ledge hog. Yeah, right here. They're gonna try to play around. Zero's gonna try to keep her lead and try to keep some distance uh, with her sword. <laughs> right there, unexpected uh, <laughs> Lariat. So you can actually, you know, you want a low profile, which is like you want to duck under it and hit her, or come at her from like above. But if you're just standing into her, you're gonna get hit. Yep, there we go, another side special leading into yet another life taken away by York. All right, only time, but you know, 21 percent. No, oh my down. goodness! Oh, oh, what a oh, oh but he did. I did great stuff. Yeah, he got he got the ledge cancel there. 
grab, leading into the back air. All right. Ooh, another grab. Oh, <gasps> aerial a little too soon there. Yeah, York's actually trying to get a little fancy with his conversions now. Oh, don't run into it. <laughs> oh, don't run into it. That, that clothesline is one of my oh, favorite. More time. Oh, got oh. up a little bit too soon. The pivot grab here. Do you know how to mash? <laughs> Uh, Nusha, not gonna lean anything. Oh, good, good wave dash back by there, uh, by Zurong. Oh, Zurong, maybe not used to the fact that Swords, Swordsman having a projectile right here. I would throw oh. Zurong neutral specials, which are projectiles. That was a good attempt. Unfortunately, not gonna get the ledge there. It so really, it really looks like Zonis. He actually doesn't get too much horizontal movement from that side special. Yep, it's very easy. So obviously, if you're grabbing the ledge, Zana is not going to be able to command grab you off of it. So if you hold the ledge there, and Zana goes opts for the horizontal recovery with her side special, Three, she's going to just fall like a rock. Yep. Go. Oh, the immediate side strike to open up this. Thing. Game three, uh, good damage, but Ooh. where are we going? Oh my goodness, straight drop Oh my kick. gosh. Trying to go for it all, not going to get it, but retreat to the platform. Oh my gosh, so obviously we see, we see York. Oh no. Trying to oh no. capitalize oh. on uh, <laughs> Rat Sark's unfamiliarity with the distance that you get from the side special here. <laughs> There's, there's a lot of unfamiliarity with, with that Larry as Ooh, well. Yes, he's still right. not ready for it. <laughs> he's not ready. <laughs> oh, okay. He's maybe, okay. If he, if he kind of reads into it and just wave dashes back into a, a side strike there, you're going to punish every time. Well, that would have been a free punish. Uh, York not aware of the way the angle is that, ooh, that up special ooh, ooh. has. Side strike. So her side, a Zurong side strike actually does have a tipper mechanic. So if you hit with the very tip of it, mm -hmm. uh, you will send the opponent further out. Okay. Uh, is that just for the side strike? Side strike, all, all of her moves. Okay. It, okay, all of her moves. Same same mechanics as uh, certain other platform fighters. What, what are you talking about? Uh, I, I mean, you know. Are you, are you talking other games? About Robin, TM from you know <laughs> Teen Titans, Slash. Line Flash. <laughs> <laughs> Need one more? No. Oh, great stuff. Right here, because of Zurong's disjointed hitbox on her sword strike, even though Zana did the counter maneuver, it was just out of range for her for her counter. And uh, we've gotten some feedback about her counter. Uh, we're considering some uh, thi Oh. <laughs> I love the attempt. <laughs> Trying to be a little extra on the read there on the platform. When you get it, though, it's super satisfying. But maybe, you know, York will be a little bit more conservative about using it left to right. I don't think so. He, he's been he's been mashing his, his, his B button, <laughs> or his special button. Oh, oh, the down tilt. Okay. Yeah, he has to be careful with his shield, though. He's putting up quite a bit. Ooh. So you could definitely punish that side strike if you wave dash out of shield there. Uh, yeah, another side strike coming out, but Rat is actually just fully adapting to what York has been playing and waiting on a lot of these grab attempts. Side Ooh. special? No. So, a funny thing about, uh, not a funny thing, but a thing about the ledge, maybe not so funny to people who like the ledge, okay. but every time you re-grab the ledge, you actually lose invincibility in, in icons. That means no infinite ledge stalling, and every time you do it, you become more and more vulnerable on the ledge. Okay. So we want to promote a bit more aggression here uh, with with icons. Okay. Uh, we, we would like you to not play like Mewtwo King. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so unfortunate. He just dropped such, down. Such a great game for Ratchark there in the beginning. Yeah. But unfortunately, there at the end, just losing that stock. Oh, it's a shame. It is a shame. It's not, it's not what you want to see. He's in the driver's seat the whole time.